Hello everybody, this is Daryl Passing Lane Motors and we just got in a new, well it's new to us, but it's really not new, it's a 1970 Chevelle. Uh, first off, let's start off by saying this is a Malibu. It is not an SS, it does say SS on it, it does say it on the fenders and on the grill. Those are badges, the dash, you'll definitely see that it is a Malibu. Um, we did an undercarriage video, the undercarriage is pretty nice in this little car. It's got one patch in the, the driver's, or sorry, excuse me, the passenger side floor pan. I said I'd shoot another little video. We're not going to make a real big deal out of this. This is definitely a driver quality car. Uh, we've got got it priced right now to reflect that. Um, the paint job is 12 years old. Uh, we did just put a brand new set of torque thrust wheels and tires on the car, uh, which may, really makes the car stand out. I mean, the car just looks outstanding now. It's got a great stance. Very, very um, muscular stance. Uh, as far as the paint job goes, it's really in pretty good shape for being a 12 year old paint job. It looks like it was done in, in a shop. Don't look like it was done in some guy's garage. Um, I'm not seeing any stress cracks in the body here, which we see in most of the cars. Um, one of the weird things is uh, these quarters all appear to be original uh, or they did complete full quarters, which is what I'm thinking they may have done on this side because there's no body line here. This side, I believe, there's no uh, cutouts in either one of these quarters. I'm thinking that whole quarter had been replaced. I think this one is factory original. Still got the body seam in it here. Uh, and then here's those pretty wheels we were just talking about. The, uh, the bright work on the car is still in really good shape. Um, does have the SS badging, does have a working cowl hood. Not just some hood stuck on here with, a little fl with no flapper. It's actually a real true working cowl hood. Does have hood pins in it. The front and rear bumpers are in really good shape. Um, we will check this car in. I believe all the lights and turn signals and everything work. If not, we always make sure that all that stuff does before we end up selling the car. Uh, let's go over the body here one time real quick. Um, as far as rust on the car, there is a, some bubbling right here in the front of the driver's door. And if we look around the wheel opening of the rear quarter, on this side, you can see that there is some blistering in the paint. There's no rust showing through. There's no rust anywhere um, visible on this car, but hey, we want everybody to be aware of that. Uh, this is a 12 year old paint job and it's still looking pretty doggone good. Go ahead and show you the interior. Dome light's still operable. You have to excuse us, we didn't even vacuum in it yet. Uh, the door panels are in really great shape. There's no rips or tears in the bucket seats. Uh, the car has a uh, stereo system in it, um, does have just a regular aftermarket tack, aftermarket steering wheel, uh, some under the dash gauges. Here is your flapper. Here, I'm going to start this car up. Watch. You see that? See that close up? Let you listen to this car. Well, it does have blue lights underneath it. Excuse me. Died there. sounds like on that camera um, we're currently idling at 60 pounds of oil pressure you can see that the engine is cold we haven't started it up yet it's putting out um, let's turn the volume up on this radio so it's got a nice stereo in it um, here's the windshield wipers they're operable Oh, we turn it off. And uh, it does have the vents in the car. You can't see in there, it's awful dark. <laughs> Got the blue lights up underneath it. Okay, hang on, I'm gonna Josh Julia around while I open this car hood. Hang on just a minute. Power steering, power 
train car. Okay, before we all die in here. So everybody, this is 1970 Chevelle. It's actually a Malibu. 408 stroker. Got a new Jasper 350 transmission in it. Uh, the, the car is for sale exactly the way you see it right now. Uh, or it will be going down to our shop and we'll make this thing into a really, really super slick car. Um, one of the things I would suggest to you, it just has straight exhaust coming right out with little cherry bombs. Uh, needs full exhaust put on it if it's purchased as is. It also could really use a stall speed torque converter, which I just ordered, which I would throw in with the car. But if we uh, install it, the price is definitely going to go up. Uh, so it's a, three fit, or a 400 small block, bored out to a 408 stroker motor, 350 turbo transmission, 12 bolt posi, bucket seats, console shift, uh, got under the car lighting, which if you can keep that or take that off, either one, whatever you like. Uh, front disc brake conversion's already been done on it, so it's got power disc brakes. The car has a great stance to it. So this is Daryl, Passing Lane Motors, 636-600-1140. It's a 1970 Chevelle, small block, automatic. Great little car, get in, drive it, and have fun. This car won't last long. Thanks so much, and have a great day. See you, bye now.